your cheap pop-up awning uh, repair. I got this at Academy Sports. I'm sure they're sold all over the U.S. under different names. This one looks like, I don't know if that'll focus, a Shade Z. I guess that's maybe who makes it for Academy. Uh, anyways, this one has a broken leg. This one has two good legs. It's a little bit of a taller unit, but I think I can just cut the top off or the bottom. I'm not sure which yet. But so disassembly, if you ever have to fix one of these and you find some parts or like I said, find this on the side of the road, you can get a screwdriver and pop this cap off here. There's a little tab right there. Just be gentle, pry it up. Now they're on this side. Let me see the arm pop out. So that's how these arms come out. And they are just a little plastic deal like that. And you could even swap that out if it broke. Or maybe that clip thing broke pole broke get you a piece of metal or just another like I said another one of these to do it so now to pull the leg out there's a little pin here and I found it easiest to pry on the inside one with a pick or a really small uh, screwdriver and they look like this they actually go all the way through that's what it looks like on the outside a little oval piece right and then on the inside they clip into each other so if this broke you could probably use a bolt or something like that but that's my plan is now to get this velcro off here so I can slide it through here and try to put it on that one all right I got the pole off the blue one you can see it's longer but the diameter is the same so just got to cut the top off and then, of course, this hole will be gone. I'll have to drill another hole. And uh, should be good to go. All right, got it in. I just eyeballed that little gap. Made it about the same there. Instead of measuring and all that crap, just do it real time, right? Shove it in. There we go. Now I got to get a marker, mark my holes, and drill through for that plastic pin thing. All right, got the pole installed, got the pins back in. All seems right. So that's the hole from the old pole. I need to make another one. So I measured this one. Mine's about six and seven eighths. If I can, there you go. Just be sure to measure yours, don't take my measurements because mine might be different of course. So I'm going to measure down six and seven eighths for the hole on the side with a little uh, pin thing or jigger there and uh, we'll give it a try. Measured the holes for the velcro, drilled them, put it on there. Looks like the others. Let's test it out. There you go. Works fine. Also, I noticed this place sells spare parts on eBay and their own website, but of course shipping on these longer poles is pretty high, so don't be afraid to fix it instead of throw it away.